Hi, my name is Siti and welcome back to the channel where we make educational technology easy for you. In today's video, we're going to add some formatting to Google Keep Notes where formatting is currently not available. So let's dive into it with another flipped classroom tutorial. Now, before we get started, make sure you subscribe and hit that bell notification so you can get notified of every new tips and tricks video being uploaded. So let's go ahead by opening our browser. Now, once we've opened our browser, there are two tabs that we want to open. We want to have one tab for our Google Keep and another tab for a website we're going to use. Now, the website we're using today is called boldtext.io. So let's go ahead and navigate to boldtext.io and make sure you also have Google Keep open either in a separate app when you're using Chrome OS or have Keep open in a separate tab. Now, boldtext.io is leveraging Unicode. Now, Unicode has thousands of characters and each character looks different and can be used in Google Keep. Now, that means that our text that is going to be bold is not really bold formatted. It just looks bold. The same goes for any of the other symbols we can use. Now, this allows us to add a couple of different fonts, a couple of different effects, and this will work on your social media profiles or any other place on the web that does not currently allow you to add formatting. Now, once you've navigated to boldtext.io, at the top, you will see a big box. Now, that's where you can paste your text. Then underneath that box, you can select the effect you would like to use for Google Keep Notes. So you can start typing your note in Google Keep. And once you get to that word or that sentence that you'd like to change, that you'd like to add a bit of formatting to, simply go to the second tab and type that in the main box. Now we're going to type in, this is a test. Now you will see once you've typed in your text, you can scroll down and you will get a couple of options right there. And the options highlighted by the website are of course, bold, italic and other effects that are used quite often. However, there are more effects available. Simply tap on show more font and this will open up a drop down list of all the available Unicode effects that you can now copy and paste into your Google Keep. Mind you, not every effect is going to work on every single platform. So let's go ahead and select one of these. Now I'm going to choose the bold serif effect and what we need to do now is, is highlight the text we would like to keep. So let's go ahead and highlight this as a test. And once you've done that, you're going to copy this. Now all that's left to do is either navigate to your Google Keep Notes or go to your social media profile where you would like to have that bold text. So let's open up our Google Keep. And once you're in Google Keep, all that's left to do is simply paste the text you've just copied. As you can see, this is a super easy way of getting bold formatting into Google Keep Notes. Now, until Google allows us some actual formatting, this is the way that you can highlight different words, sentences, and then share these notes with others. I hope you found this helpful. If you did, don't forget to subscribe, hit the bell, and it would always help if you liked this video. And I will see you again next week with another flipped classroom tutorial. Thank you for watching.